where should you advertise your business as a media buyer one of the most asked questions that i get from business owners is this i always like oh i need to create more awareness generate more leads and sales for my business where exactly should i advertise and this is my recommendation here are five channels that you can effectively advertise your business to reach more customers number one facebook you're able to target your audience by age interest location with facebook ads and even gender which means you are most likely targeting the right kind of people that might need your product or service with facebook ads you get over 2 billion people both on the facebook platform and also on the instagram platform to get started with facebook ads you are going to need a couple things a couple of things sorry the first is a facebook account and the second is your facebook page thirdly you would also need an instagram account your instagram account would most likely be connected to your facebook page so that when your ad is running on facebook with your facebook page your ad will also be shown on instagram with your instagram profile now um regarding the destination to send traffic to that is traffic from facebook you can run different type of ads on facebook you can run awareness campaigns you can run engagement campaigns and you can run sales campaigns uh, if you're running ads to generate leads you can run ads that for lead generation that is who can fill and submit a form on facebook and then facebook sends data of people that have submitted the form they send it to you and then you can then follow up for your business another option is in some locations you can actually send people to start a conversation with your business and you can do this by sending people to your whatsapp business or to your facebook messenger or to your instagram dm now um, in my experience the most effective has always been a whatsapp business so if you are in a location that actually supports that you can explore that option now if you have a website this is actually very good for you because then you will be track will be getting higher intent traffic which are traffic that are more likely to convert so you can send traffic to your website or to maybe submit a lead or to book an appointment to schedule an inspection that's if you run a real estate business or if you run an e-commerce business you can just go directly and get people to your product page and get conversions from there so that is importance of facebook and instagram ads aside the ones i've mentioned you can also retarget people that have interacted with your brand in the past go and check it any business any e-commerce business right now in the world is effectively advertising on facebook and instagram they are the number one for e-commerce business so you can also try this for your business the second platform that you can uh, advertise your business on is the google ads platform you know now before you when people are trying to find out new things they go on google and they search oh i need to buy a new bike i need to locate a spa so google is actually a very great platform to advertise your business and with google ads get options like search ads these are ads that really focus on keywords keywords are search terms that people use on google so let's say you are running an ad for your business now you can bid on the keywords like oh hotels around me hotels in the us or you can say oh buy a bike 
you can uh, you can actually bid on keywords like that and when people search for these keywords if you are running an ad on google your ad has a higher chance of showing up in the first or second page of google and then people can oh, oh these people have a bike to sell and then click on it so those are search ads another type of google ad is display ads uh, display ads are basically you know um image or gifs that show on millions of websites around the world and on mobile apps as well if you've ever used a free mobile app you see after you've done a particular action some kind of ads would show that you have to maybe watch a video or an image so those are display ads and if you're also a business owner and you need to drive more awareness for your brand these kind of ads are usually very cheap so you'll be getting a lot of traffic and impression for your budget another google ad type that you can use that you can make use of for your business is the youtube ads we all watch youtube we go on youtube to learn to discover new things and you can also run youtube ads for your brand youtube ads are usually video ads and they show up why people are using YouTube or why they are searching on YouTube. So with Google Ads, you're going to need a couple of things. One, you're going to need a Google Ad account. A Google Ad account is usually created from your Gmail account. So um, from your Google Ad account, you also need to, if you have a website, you would actually need a website. You would have to, integrate a google analytics tag and the google ad tag on your website so you'll be able to track accurately the conversions that come from different sorts of traffic on your website so those are two things you need to get started with google ads the third platform that you can focus on as a business owner is the linkedin ads platform LinkedIn is home to lots of professionals, um, CEOs, managing directors, and a lot of business owners and professionals are on LinkedIn. So if you have a business, if you have like a B2B business, you need to connect with C-suit executives, decision makers of your industry, LinkedIn would be the more efficient place to advertise your business say you have a product or a software as a service and you need to you know connect with large organization linkedin is the way to go to get started on linkedin you need your linkedin profile and you also need a linkedin page and then you need to linkedin ads manager go to linkedin ads manager and that is where you can create your ads on linkedin there are different type of ads you can you can you know you can run on linkedin you can run for lead generation you can run for awareness and you can also run ads that direct to websites direct people from linkedin to your website to take an action fourth platform that you can focus on is advertising on twitter twitter is also an effective platform you can run ads that direct people to your website on twitter you know twitter is a place that encourages interaction you can run ads that allow your customers to engage with your tweets allow them to take an action on your tweets on twitter they are actually called promotions you can promote your tweets and you can promote your product as well but out of out of these four platforms i've mentioned i think the first three are actually much more effective than twitter so if you're actually a starter and if you're a new business owner it would be very good to you know focus on uh, say facebook instagram and google as opposed to twitter the fifth method don't let me i'm using the word method because it's actually a method it's not a platform that you can use to advertise your 
product or service effectively is by liaison with influencers and this is called influencer marketing and with influencer marketing you can you can connect with uh, micro or macro influencers in your industry say on tiktok on instagram on facebook or on twitter and then ask these people to put out series of posts for you so you are actually leveraging on the audience that these influencers have and you are using it to you know advertise your business as well this is actually very good because you know influencers have earned lots of trust with their audience so when they promote a business the audience are actually very much more probable to take action Aside this five that i've mentioned there are a lot of other platforms as well i'm intentionally not mentioning tiktok here because tiktok is not available in a lot of locations yet it's available in the us uk and some european countries it's not really available for lots of people in africa so but there is tiktok ads you can use with tiktok influencers as well um there is pinterest ads there's snapchat ads i'm sure you don't know that people do ads on snapchat yes they do there are a lot of ads on snapchat and with all these not so popular platforms you can actually be getting more cheaper you know more cheaper cost for your ads so those are the channels that you can focus on as a business owner to advertise your business and my my recommendation as a media buyer is start um very small uh, one of the best places to start is with facebook and instagram ads with time you can also go to youtube ads if you have the budget for it thanks very much for watching to the end of this video i really hope that you found this helpful and you can implement some of the things i've said in your business thank you please i would really appreciate if you can you know subscribe to my channel and you can also share this video for more visibility i'll see you next time and i hope your business succeeds bye